Okay, welcome to another exhilarating episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy VI. Before I prepare myself to fight Kefka, I just want to take care of our pesky little aerial friend. And of course, I'm talking about Death Gaze. Now, I already hit him with like four of them <laughs> bum rushes, so I think that mofo is going to go down pretty soon. Now, Wall Ring doesn't protect against Doom. And her level is a multiple of five, so we may have to level her up just to avoid all the... Hey, they're both of them... Both the girls that died, that both their levels are a multiple of five, so. May have to level them up. Checks against Doom. I don't want to level them up, so I'm just going to let them die. As lazy as that sounds. Duff gaze, hell yeah. Chainsaw. And he used the right chainsaw. Arrow. Heal yourself. Okay, so I guess Terror is the only one left biting the dust. So it popped out of his mouth. Yep, that officially means the skies are clear. Now is this a continent that has Kefka's tower? It seems really anticlimactic that his tower is around here. Skills, magic. So we only have one Esper left to go. So you're gonna, you only have that kind of MP. For this version of Final Fantasy VI, that's the closest we'll ever get to a super boss. So it's by no means 
uh, Yazimich or that nigga from Final Fantasy X, what's his face, Penance. It's not even a Kaiser Dragon. It's not even an ultimate weapon. It's not even what's his face from Final Fantasy Ruby or Emerald weapon. It's none of those guys. Now, as for the Espers, if she would have been alive, then she would have learned all these skills right there. But we're, we're going to have to have like three f more fights to get that shit. Okay, Flare. From Bahamut, we get Flare, and we also get the most badass summon in this game. But it's not the final summon, so... We're approaching endgame. I'm gonna prepare for that. This is Mr. Wonka 7 and suck my dick.